Hi, hey, hello, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. My name is Shelly, and today... I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> today, uh, it's the next installment of Project Audiobook. I don't know why I do voices sometimes and weird accents, but I do, and I just cannot stop. So, today's episode, South Sea series, I don't like it. So today I will be talking about the selection series. So let's see if I can remember it from the top of my head. We have the selection, the elite, the one, the novella compilation, Happily Ever After, The Heir, and The Crown. I'm pretty sure that's all of them. <laughs> so, it's technically a trilogy, and then I, whatchamacallit when you do a, a spin-off series, there you go. So, it's a trilogy with a spin-off series of a duology. <laughs> That's what you call it. Oh, I'm so good at this. Words fail me every day, every day. Anyway, so I don't remember when I read these books, as in physically read these books, but it's been a while. And I mean, at the time I read them, they they weren't for my age group, let's say. They were a bit, they were targeted at, you know, the teens and I was in my 20s. So, a little later. <laughs> Not to say that it's, it, 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 you cannot enjoy books when you're older for a younger audience because I read middle grade and YA all the time. It's, it's just kind of my go-to. You know, they're easy to read and they are usually fantastical. So, who am I to judge? That was not the point. <laughs> so, I mean, they weren't like the best books ever written or the best series ever written or anything like that. But it's kind of a, I want to say it's like a nostalgia kind of thing. They're just easy. You just breeze through them and get, you know, that little kick of having read another book and you didn't, you know, get stuck into it. Well, maybe you got stuck into it, but you didn't like... It didn't put you in a reading slump because it was just too much for your brain. Well, I guess they could too because it's not... They, they don't actually give you that much. But they're funny to read, so... I'm just going off on a tangent now, aren't I? Yes, I am. Okay, let's, let's move it back to the story at hand. <laughs> so... Listening to the selection series, I'm just going to call it all six books, a whole full series, even though there's novellas and it's a spin-off duology and whatever. It's a full series now, in my head, for the purpose of this video. <laughs> they could have had a better narrator. I'll leave it at that. Because it was a bit... It, at points, it got a bit, a bit, you know, too much. So the selection series, the basic premise for it is basically the Bachelor meets dystopian world, something like that. And I mean, it, it's a premise. It, it can work. But it gets a bit too... I don't want to say childish, but that's basically the only word I can think of for explaining what I mean. So it gets a bit childish, it gets a bit too... Meh, meh, meh. And the narrator for whom I listened to for... Well, they came in some other narrators as well, but 
all of the narrators that jumped in every here and again, it made it a bit too much. And also the fact that um, the character, the different characters, so it was mostly the same narrator for most of the books, um, but then when they did the novellas, they did different narrators, and the one that portrayed um, the queen, that the the queen in the first series. Um, so she was the one that went through the selection before America, her name is, goes through it in the selection. The, the narrator for her in the novellas, um, she put on this kind of a Spanish accent kind of a deal where for all the other narrating parts of said character, even during the novellas when they portrayed her, that character in in the novellas, other other narrators portrayed the Queen. Um, they didn't put on that accent, so it was a bit like, why does she have that accent now, but she doesn't have it everywhere else? It's like, can you please keep like a theme to it all or something? But yeah, I don't, I don't know. Maybe because I don't, I don't have any. But but, but I I got annoyed with that. But if you cannot tell, so I mean, it wasn't the best listening experience, and I will not be listening to those series again. If I ever do pick up that series again, I will be reading them physically. Uh, I just enjoy that process a lot more. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't great. That's... I think that's what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, that, that's, that has to be it for today. <laughs> that has got to be it for this video because, yeah, yeah. So, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, take care. Oh, bye-bye.